going to be studying abroad next year in Osaka, Japan. I'm going to be studying at Osaka University, taking classes and studying the language. That's in Osaka, not in Tokyo. I hope you guys look forward to some cool videos because I'm definitely looking forward to making them. I will see you in the next video. Peace. Yeah! Obviously, the number one benefit you're going to get from going abroad is you're going to learn a language. And uh, that's going to help your life in a lot of different ways. So what else can you gain from studying abroad? You will definitely get friends. Um, and I'm not just talking about friends of the host country. Along with making tons of Japanese friends, I also made a lot of friends with people around the world who happen to be studying in Japan. And, you know, one of the pluses of living in our time is when you have a network of global friends, it's super easy to stay in contact. How's Germany, dude? It's so easy. Like, what, what do you have to lose from getting a network of global friends? One thing definitely I think a lot of people overlook as a reason to study abroad is food. Food. You, there's so much good food abroad. Other countries you're going to get exposed to so many different types of food. And apart from the food itself, you're going to learn a different culture of food. And you know, just like language, this is an essential part of learning another culture as you learn their food. The way they eat, the customs of how they eat, what kind of social interactions accompany eating. Those kind of things can be really fascinating. And that's something that, you know, if you stay in your own country and you go to a Chinese or a French restaurant, you're not gonna learn no matter how good the food is. This is delicious! <laughs> one thing I definitely want to address is, uh, I think one reason a lot of students don't go abroad is because they feel like they have to leave their hobbies behind or go on hiatus for a year. That's definitely not true. I like to make videos. I, I'm an aspiring filmmaker. So I brought a video camera with me to Japan and I, I was able to hook up with a local filmmaker and I helped him with a lot of his films and I got to continue my passion abroad. So don't ever limit yourself to doing your hobby in just one place. <laughs> Basically any reason you can think of why not to study abroad, that reason's probably not true and you should probably just go. So but I'd like to end this video with just kind of a collage of a lot of cool shots that I got while I was abroad and, and I challenge you all to think about what kind of experiences you could create for yourself going abroad and um, what you might be able to gain from it. So, enjoy!